That is why some patients feel like they have half a drink and it hits them like three drinks. There's, this is a pattern I hear over and over. People who used to drink socially cannot tolerate alcohol anymore. They did not suddenly become lightweights. Their biology changed. Alcohol tolerance is metabolic tolerance. It reflects the capacity of the liver, the mitochondria, and the autonomic nervous system to absorb the stress of a toxin and clear it fast enough that you do not feel sick. Before COVID, most patients could oxidize alcohol quickly. They had predictable responses. One or two drinks felt normal. A hangover was rare. After long COVID, alcohol tolerance collapses. Even half a drink triggers flush. A rapid heart rate, a headache, nausea, or a next day crash. This is not psychological. This is impaired clearance at a cellular level. Alcohol is a solvent toxin. To handle it, you need functioning mitochondria, normal redox balance, adequate glutathione, steady acetaldehyde dehydrogenase activity, and normal blood flow. Long COVID pushes against all of those systems. If your mitochondria are already struggling to make ATP, any additional oxidative load will push them into the red zone. That manifests as next morning fatigue, post-exertional malaise, internal tremors, or even brain fog surge. If your glutathione system is depleted, acetaldehyde lingers longer. That means the pounding headache and the feeling like you've aged 10 years overnight. If you have autonomic dysfunction, alcohol exaggerates those swings. First, you feel sedated and relaxed. Then you get rebound tachycardia, anxiety, or a sympathetic surge that feels like panic. If you have histamine intolerance or mast cell activation, fermented drinks hit histamine. But even distilled alcohol destabilizes mast cells through increased acetaldehyde. That leads to flushing, itching, sinus congestion, or chest tightness. Many patients tell me the same thing. Alcohol is the fastest path to the next day crash. It does not take binge drinking. It could be a few ounces of tequila or vodka. Loss of tolerance is information. It is a signal that your metabolic and autonomic reserve is low. It is a sign that oxidative stress and mitochondrial dysfunction are still active. It is also a clue that your recovery is incomplete. When tolerance returns, it usually means your mitochondria are handling the load again. Your redox buffering is back. Your autonomic system is ready. Your endothelial function is improving. So loss of alcohol tolerance is not a moral failure. It is part of long COVID phenotype. Your body is telling you the truth about its current capacity.